Hello my friends, welcome all of you, almost 108,000 wanderers, lightworkers and starseeds to this session. Today I have channeled the Galactic Federation in order to answer very interesting questions which are absolutely amazing and this session was really valuable in terms of information. The first question which I have asked is about what precisely is a kundalini awakening and how can we activate it uh, which this session goes in depth so you will understand not only about what it really means uh, how can we activate it has been revealed furthermore in this session also the galactic federation has given this as a message to humanity uh, regarding the current happenings in the universe and uh, they have covered that in the beginning portion as well as towards the end of the session I have asked a truth about the Skinwalker Ranch. Now I don't know if many of you are aware of this or not but the Skinwalker Ranch is a famous location wherein there have been many extraterrestrial activities and many different types of activities like cattle mutilations and all other things occurring in that location which has been described in this session and also towards the end of the session I have asked also about what is the Starseed project uh, which I had never heard about before but it uh, it seems to be uh, a project which is happening in our galaxy which has been revealed in this session and I hope I want to say before the session begins thank you to all of you who have joined on my patreon because I've released some recent sessions which also go in deep uh, about the happenings in the current system of our galaxy as well as many other important sessions have been released in my patreon and also you can access to around 450 plus uh, channel messages and also you can take part in meditations with us to protect earth from the negative entities if you want to join the link is on the description as well as i want to say thank you to all of you for liking this video as it is a service to humanity and what you like will ultimately return back to you and with that being said enjoy the session my friends We are the Galactic Federation now in communication through these instruments vibratory systems as we commune from our location in the Saturn rings we the Galactic Federation are here to offer our insights and thoughts at this time for the human collective social memory complex find itself entering into advanced levels of stages of ascension however the negatively oriented entities are also planning to enter into stages of activating their own protocols at this time and hence the most intense phase of ascension is undergoing in the earth planet which may be considered as a tug of war between the negative entities who are trying to prevent the earth planet from entering into a positively polarized vibration and the entities primarily who are working towards the bringing forth of the love and light in the universal complex therefore we the galactic federation must state that at this time, we have a message to the citizens of the Earth planet that it is time for all to prepare within this illusion complex for the most advanced stage of ascension and awakening as the highest possible stage of ascension and awakening is happening in this time.
The query which is in order relates primarily when, what precisely is a Kundalini awakening, and how can it be activated. We the Galactic Federation must now answer this query related with the aspect of Kundalini as known by your people, which primarily denotes a energetic frequency which is primarily dormant, which lies within each individualized portion of consciousness, unknowing that it can realize its full potential within each mind-body-spirit complex there is present a substantial reserve of untapped potential energy, which is waiting to be harnessed by such a desirous individualized entity. This energetic pattern is patiently waiting to be unlocked as the journey of becoming an enlightened being is still under process in the earth planet, and many have not finished their aspects of truly becoming a enlightened being. Further, we must state that the concept as known by your people as Kundalini primarily emphasizes the ongoing opportunity for self-realization, self-awareness, and self-improvement into an illusion of a greater and more enlightened and creator-centered version of the self in the evolutionary pathway of understanding the various lessons in the various densities of consciousness when each entity were in the second density consciousness as animal life forms there was no conscious desires present to become a human entity at the time however it was a natural progression after the learning of the second density lessons for such an entity to become a human being in the third density. However, once many begin to attain the aspects of bodily complex of a human, mind-body-spirit complex after graduating from the second density, the unconscious evolutionary cycle ceases and there is a certain self-awareness which arises within each mind-body-spirit complex. At this time, many entities, they still remain unaware, wherein they are unable to learn fully the lessons of self-awareness. And these entities primarily have to realize that it becomes essential for a evolution of further activity in this time and in this aspects of alignment consciousness is the prerequisite for any type of meaningful evolutionary journey or change in the patterns of a mind body spirit complex this untapped reservoir of energetic vibrations is primarily a type of energetic gold mine that can be utilized by the people of the earth planet in order to bring forth transformations and to become more self-aware. This energetic frequency primarily is like a treasure which is being explored by the conscious awareness of each entity which is allowing for the pathway of consciousness evolution to begin. Further, we the Galactic Federation must now state that the vibration of how can the aspects of Kundalini be tapped into, which is an unexplored potential energetic vibration that can lead an entity towards higher stages of densities of consciousness and enlightenment. Furthermore, in the aspects of realization that within the human bodily complex there exists a point wherein there is a energetic culmination of frequencies which primarily are 
for the purpose of understanding of your people, subdivided into seven chakras, which primarily represents the connectors, or the points of energetic culmination and union. In these seven energy centers, the energies represent the different types of frequency alignments and vibratory signatures, whereas also the different types of natures of the lessons which are triggered when each of these aspects are activated. Furthermore, once an entity learns to open a energetic center within the self there is a flow of energy into that energy center which allows it to open and allows the energy to flow from the energy center to the next energy center wherein there are also certain types of blockages which must be released in order to allow for the energy to transfer to the next energy center and by doing such the energy centers primarily will begin to become aligned furthermore as each energy center opens up there is a formidable energy and a force which allows for the energies of the various dimensional spaces to enter into such a mind body spirit complexes vortex which allows the untapped potential of the kundalini awakening to happen when all of the energy centers are aligned the entity begins to feel a rush of energetic frequency which is more powerful than any type of energetic vibrations found upon the earth planet and these energy frequencies once reaches the crown center will touch the helm of the creator's presence within each mind body spirit complex allowing for the access of the divine intelligence infinity which allows such an entity to not only affect space-time but also affects time-space in a manner which may be considered as positive we must also state that in order to balance all the energy centers it is a type of lesson which can be done for a short period of time however the continuous expansion of the energy of kundalini is equivalent to providing energy to the entire milky way galaxy and we must state that the aspect of kundalini primarily must be practiced in a stable fashion and in a steady manner all energy centers must be slowly activated the activation points primarily revolve around the aspects of focusing on each energy center and releasing any traps energies and other belief systems related to such a energy center leading to the opening and allowance of energy from one energy center to the next furthermore we shall now at this time answer the second query placed today related with what is happening in the location named by your people as kin walker ranch with the galactic federation state firstly that there have been many anomalies which have been spotted at the skinwalker ranch furthermore there have been certain things which have been spotted such as bright lights flying objects strange vibratory sound complexes and electrical disturbances as well as mutilations of animal bodily complexes which have been spotted and we must state that indeed the occurrences which have been happening in the skinwalker ranch is primarily as a testament to provide that there is another parallel dimension which can be accessed from that location we must state that the skinwalker ranch is located in such a location which provides entities who are 
in a way able to access the dimensional space-time and create a type of rupture in the space-time architecture and travel from one universe location to another, using it much as a portal to travel into the Earth's planetary grid. We must state firstly that the Skinwalker Lounge is a portal which primarily is being used by mostly negatively polarized extraterrestrial entities since these entities do not respect the free will of the Earth planetary sphere, thereby causing many of them to enter into the Earth's planetary grid, which results in such types of cattle mutilations and other aspects which are spotted. Furthermore, we must state that the vibration of the other portion of the query relates primarily with what is the Star Seed Project, with the Galactic Federation must state firstly that the Star Seed Project primarily is a project which was created in collaboration with the Elohim Social Memory Collective as well as all other nine positively polarized extraterrestrial social memory complexes who are in the density of sixth density and higher for the purpose of providing a type of support in the growth and evolution of consciousness throughout the cosmos. Furthermore, we the Galactic Federation must state that as per the Starseed Project, this is primarily a type of involvement wherein those entities who are from other planets ready for graduation will primarily be escorted to the Earth planet for this upcoming graduation period of 2030. Further, this is the primary point, which is the assistance of the human collective to allow for more positive vibrations to enter into. Many of the star seeds are those beings who are already at a level of later third density, ready to graduate. Hence, we, the Galactic Federation, now leave you beloved. Bye. So, my friends, let me give you a brief summary of what I learned in the session. Basically, Galactic Federation said that right now. Uh, we should prepare ourselves because the stage, this is like a tug of war, of spiritual tug of war, which is now beginning because uh, the negative entities, they're also trying to stop the earth from entering into the new earth, as well as we are trying to push earth into the new earth. There is this spiritual warfare happening and we need to accordingly choose more positivity, more of a higher vibration, uh, emotions such as love, joy, and I believe by doing that, we will help in the ascension also as per my knowledge from this session kundalini awakening simply refers to the untapped energy which becomes opened up when all of our energy centers they allow the energy of kundalini to flow uh, without any blockages and it requires us to unblock all of our energy centers by learning certain lessons or by doing meditations and if you are able to unlock the energy centers then the action will be found at the highest level in the crown center it will connect with intelligent energy which will then be so much more powerful as described in the session and also galactic federation has stated uh, that we can activate our kundalini uh, for a short period of time as well also the what i learned about the skinwalker ranch is that it is stated that skinwalker ranch has some kind of portal which allows other dimensional entities to enter into the earth planet and specifically the cattle mutilations and other uh, animal mutilations suggest that uh, as per the galactic federation the negative entities are primarily the ones who are using this portal to enter into the earth planet to affect the human consciousness and also uh, with that being said i hope you learn about the star seed project which is simply stated that the star seeds are 
coming from all over uh, the various locations from other star systems to assist Earth in this ascension period. And with that being said, I hope you enjoyed this session. If you want to know about your own soul's name, your soul identity, your past lives, and whether you are a star seed or not, you can send me an email. I will channel for you. And also, I want to say thank you to all of you who have visited my website. Link is on the description where you can read transcripts. You can listen, you can read session transcripts. You can search anything you want. It is amazing and you can visit it. The link is on the description as well. And with that being said, I'll see you in the next session, my friends. Until then, enjoy this session over here.